do we have here? So in my video for STFU, I talked about racial microaggressions and how frustrating it is when people are quite ignorant about Asian culture. I'm really hungry, so I'm going to eat this snack. They sell these for like 10p in Japan and whenever I used to go back to Tokyo for summer holidays I used to eat these all the time. This is allegedly corn chowder flavour so we will see how that tastes. She wants. 
and I really like that. Yes, I love Rosalia. I think she is an amazing performer and she's doing something very new. I would love to collaborate with... Um, can you hear? I don't think you can hear that. Oh my god, that is so fucking weird. Yeah, I'd like to collaborate with Casey Musgraves because last year on my Spotify wrapped my top 10 songs were all Casey Musgraves and so I think I've kind of failed as an artist to listen to more diverse sounds but I don't really care oh that's so weird what fans don't know about me is that if you invite me over to your house after I've left you will always find my socks in between the sofa cushions because I have a habit of taking my socks off in random places in other people's homes. I am scared of absolutely everything. I'm scared of the dark. I'm scared of deep sea. I'm scared of pools. I'm scared of the park. Oh, this is kind of scary. I'm a very grateful person in general. I'm most grateful for my dog. She's great. She's better than a lot of humans. I'm really grateful, actually, that my parents moved to the UK when I was younger. Because I think I saw a lot in the world um, living in London that perhaps maybe if I grew up in Tokyo it wouldn't have been the same. My hidden talent is leaving socks everywhere. No, um, my hidden talent is that I can smell my own feet, like, backwards. So, like, I can, like, stick my neck up and then bring it, like, from my shoulder and then I can smell my own feet. It's a really useful, deeply useful life skill. Oh, look, there it is. There's a spot. Oh, yeah. happening in my life I make sure that the fundamentals are like set I'm getting enough sleep I'm not on social media I am eating well and then I always I'm trying to always reach out always reach out to people if there is chaos in your life because you're not an inconvenience to talk about your problems even with music like collaboration is so important um, so whenever you're feeling um, stuck. Reach out. I just really want to know who actually uses this as soap. No one asked for this. Who woke up one day and was like, oh my god, you know what? It'd be so sick if there was like soap, but it's in the shape of a rose. Absolutely no one asked for this. I would say that one of the hardest parts of being a multicultural artist is the feeling that you don't belong anywhere. I think just anyone who is multicultural or mixed race or, you know, if you stand between any sort of two areas in your life, whether your parents are one thing and you're another or whatever, I think that can cause quite a lot of confusion early on. But I think the world's becoming more and more like just a global culture and it's becoming more and more acceptable to be two things three things four things yeah it's it's nice that you've got like two different places to call home i guess so i'm going on tour i'm doing a u.s canada and the uk tour we are kicking off in la on the 20 24th of april and then we are going through the states and then up into canada and then we'll be finishing in london in the uk it's called the dynasty tour get your tickets now because it's selling fast this time i will be touring with the band because before i used to be a dj and two dancers but i was like we need to switch it up um so we're bringing on two band members and two dancers it's gonna be crazy I'm very eco-conscious. <laughs> you know, like, the planet is kind of a bit fucked at the moment, so I think it's really important as artists to be 
touring responsibly because touring is so bad for the environment. Anyway, I've, I've written a song about that, I think, yeah-ish, um, which is called Excess, and that's also on the album too, so. I hope you enjoyed my mind massage. My name is Rina Soyama. My debut album is out 17th of April.